morning y'all happy monday today actually this week is a huge week which i'm really excited for it's launch week for the o kind we just have a lot going on and then i leave saturday to travel for basically two straight weeks so i'm giving myself a nice self-care day i already did a bunch of like boring self-care stuff yesterday like cleaning the house organizing laundry blah blah, blah whatever this morning i'm going on a long walk at katie trail i'm getting some starbucks i have a massage at 10 30 at the now Squeeze opening here soon and I like cannot wait. Yeah, it's gonna be a really great self-care day We're gonna be back to cooking. We're gonna get groceries for the week. Like I am just so Excited for my outfit. This long sleeve is Aritzia. I think hoodies Aritzia the biker shorts are Ultra voices. I have my Lulu bag my white Nikes my running house my hat Also, y'all know I'm always showing cookbooks, and I got two recent ones from Page Street Publishing. They actually publish nearly 150 original titles a year. It's crazy, but they specialize in cookbooks and adult craft books. So we have the Tex Mux table and then the Share and Savor. Obviously, I love the Tex Mux table because Tex Mux is like my favorite food. You know, I literally have a Texas tattoo. Big fan. Um, I eat it at least twice a week, but I really never make it from home, so I'm actually really excited. On self-care days, I also like trying out different recipes. So we are gonna make something today. I like just practicing things too before I actually, oh my God, this has been like my go-to when I order. So thank you to Page Street Publishing for sponsoring this portion of the vlog. I will link both of these books and both of the authors in the description down below. Um, and then later today, I'm gonna make a recipe from one of these things. Oh my gosh, a spicy pineapple marg. That actually sounds so good. That's what we were getting in Cabo. I'm starting a new series where I make drinks like for the summer from home with friends and I have like a guest on and whatever. So I'm probably gonna use a drink recipes for that. So I'm gonna go walk the Katy Trail. I normally do this with a friend. I've actually never walked it alone. And I'm actually pretty good about going and doing things alone. Like I go work out alone most of the time. But for some reason, I just like could never get myself to go alone. I think it's maybe the discipline of it. Because with a class I'm booked and with Katie Trail, like you just go walk in whenever you want, you know? It's like an at-home workout. I'm starting to get like nervous kind of because at this point the Okine will have launched the New York live shows up too if you guys want to go. We're doing a New York live show for the podcast with Margot Austria as our guest on June 20th. Tickets are available. We have GA and then we have VIP. There's a very limited amount of both left. So I would grab some friends and go make it a girls night. Um, and VIP is just like a meet and greet. You get to come early. We get to hang out and like spend time together for a GA. I don't think that that's really like possible. Anyways, I wouldn't say I'm having like imposter syndrome like I talked about this more in the last vlog. Um, I'm gonna like sit down and film something for that, but maybe it is. I'm just like, maybe it is. I'm just getting a little bit nervous. So anyways, the next few weeks are crazy. I go to Arizona, then I go to LA, then I go to Indio for coach, not Coachella, for Stagecoach, which I'm so excited for. I did not feel any FOMO with um, Coachella this year. I just like didn't care to go. Um, but stagecoach, yeah, that's different. And then I come back for two days and then I leave again for New York. So I am a busy girl currently. So I needed a nice little self-care day. Just had the best morning. Ooh getting my steps in. I made, I'm not exaggerating, probably like 10 TikToks. I go on those walks, it's crazy. Like you would think that I just like took an Adderall or something, I've never taken an Adderall in my life. It's the last thing I need. I just got so much done. Um, I'm also like unhinged there. Like I, I had some TikToks pop off this weekend and I literally think I'm the coolest girl. Not really, but like I'm feeling pretty good about it, you know? Now that I'm like a TikTok star and all, like things have changed, things are looking up. Oh, oh my God. Okay, I literally think I'm the funniest person ever. The Starbucks on Knox just sucks. Like if you know, you know, the vibe is just off. And this is what I just made. <laughs> oh, what has scary music? Going to get a massage at the now. Um, I thought I booked an 80 minute, but on my Google calendar, it's only an hour. So I either just forgot to put an 80 or I really just booked a 50. 
I don't know. I'm just so excited. And then I'm gonna grocery shop, which we know I love. Maybe we'll even go to Sprouts. Actually, yes, we're going to Sprouts. That is truly a self-care day. It takes me forever to drink this coffee. Best coffee ever orders on my Instagram. So when y'all are in line and DMing me last minute, you don't have to do that. You can just go to my highlights. Okay, we're off. Question really quick. What length of vlogs do you guys like the best? Like under 20, 30, or above 45? Or like 45? Um, and how many vlogs a week do you want? Like two? Do you want sit down videos? I feel like that's like for like new viewers normally. You know when you just like walk out and you're disoriented also I got an 80 minute massage I thought I'd really need it but like I just kept thinking about everything I need to do like it was relaxing and it was a good massage but the entire I just couldn't shut my brain off um so I'm so glad that I did it but I did have some more ideas so anyways we're gonna go to sprouts in a second I'm I need to send some emails but you know you win some you lose some I tried my best I do love massages. I probably should have just done it on a day. No, I don't know. I, maybe it's just my brain. Like, I needed to, like, turn it off, and it wasn't fully turning off. I was, I was trying, though. I just took a shower. Oh wait, guys. I'm home now. I put on a really cozy outfit. I did some skincare. I lit some candles around the house. I'm going to sit on the couch and order my outfits for stagecoach. I do have to get a little bit of work done today. Well, I always have to get work done, but so I'm just gonna do that from the comfort of my house. Just feels good. Probably gonna play Texas Country, put the morning toast on. Um, but I did get lunch at Sprouts because I didn't feel like cooking for lunch. Alright y'all, no one's gonna be surprised. I'm going to Trader Joe's. I need to get more flowers. Um, and then also... I need to get stuff to make the pineapple marks because I totally changed my mind on what I'm gonna make tonight. In case you were wondering, when I was sitting there working, I did spill coffee all over my white coffee table. Thank God it wasn't on the couch. Um, could have been worse, but also, you know, could have been better. So anyways, I'm off to Trader Joe's. I'm wearing slippers, but like, it's okay, we're fine. Here's what I picked up flower-wise. Baby's breath, and cute. These are not my normal flowers. I'm just trying something new for spring. Florals for spring groundbreaking. All right, I wish I had this glassware, but I'm about to make my spicy pineapple margaritas. This is what I have right now. Already out, ready to go. Also, a little sneak peek, guys. Anyways, it looks so cute. I'm really excited. being a bartender. It's actually really good. Wow. I am so impressed on myself. Like, are you kidding? This drink is so good. Okay, again, it's in the Tex Max cookbook. I'll have it linked below and I'll tag all their Instagrams below from Page Street Publishing. It's This is 
currently me. I'm home now. I made some dinner. A friend came over and then my cousin just moved here. Guys, I can't take myself seriously. I went and I saw him. I always have my water. This is my breadwinning housewife cup. I bring this up to bed every night. And then I also turn on my lights. I'll turn these on to like red light therapy. I have a night routine up. I just got a new phone. So like nothing is connected right now. Oh, there we go. Like it is the best vibe. Oh my God. I can't take myself seriously, but I do this for about 30 minutes. So honestly, I'm gonna watch TikTok while I do this and then I go about spice so much faster. The blue is like anti-inflammatory, I believe. It helps a lot with breakouts. So like I only get hormonal breakouts. I have them right now and they're going down so much with this. Like this and collagen really helps me, but I haven't really been taking collagen. So this is my room. This is my vibe at night. It is so relaxing. I know you guys have seen it a bunch. Fitz like just lays here until eventually he'll come. Oh, come sit by me, right, bub? Come on, bub. Do you wanna come up? Oh, ho, ho, you're so perfect. My pajamas are Soma. Um, this is a great self-care day. Hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to subscribe if you guys haven't already. Um, so many vlogs. The next one will be the Okan Blanche vlog, which is crazy. Love you guys. Check out Paige Street Publishing's Tex-Mex cookbook. Um, I'll have everything linked below.